filming for HBO's Batgirl film, starring Leslie Grace in the titular role and Michael Keaton as the Dark Knight himself, continued to get underway in Glasgow on Tuesday. Crew members were seen using machinery to hoist a brick wall mural of Batman and Robin into place, while elsewhere a billboard for fictional coffee shop Sundollar was given its finishing touches as the city's transformation into Gotham nears completion. Other photographs showed set dressers converting a local newsagent into a flower shop while fellow crew members appeared to deliberate the set's development. Heavy-duty machinery was used to maneuver props into place and crew donned high-vis bibs. Others wore paint-splattered workwear and huddled around a wooden workbench. Taking a break, the crew members were also seen visiting a small hut selling Dutch pancakes. It comes after Glasgow residents were offered free earplugs and blackout blinds due to disturbance caused by the filming of HBO Max's upcoming film, which saw crew members erect graffiti-covered boards featuring Batman, teacups and crabs on two walls on Monday. Acting as the fictional Gotham, where Batman and his femme fatale cousin reside. Scotland's second city is said to be filled with noisy vehicle chases into the early hours. The blockbuster's production company, American Night, has reportedly posted letters through the door boxes of local residents and businesses as a warning. Those who call the city's Trongate district their home will see their streets transformed into scenes from a superhero movie. Flashing lights and pedestrian management have been introduced. According to the Daily Record, the note reads, We mentioned in our previous letter that considering the antisocial hours of some of our work we can provide blackout material for windows and or foam earplugs to anybody who feels they may need them. We have been given permission by Glasgow City Council to install temporary road closures during our filming and related work, to ensure the safety of both the wider public and our film crew while we operate near these roads. As mentioned previously, there may also be a requirement for some pedestrian management within the area. For those homes and businesses in the immediate vicinity this may mean that we have to ask people to wait for a short period of time before being escorted to from their destination. We appreciate that this may be an inconvenience and will endeavor to keep waiting times as short as possible. The much awaited superhero project has been in the works ever since 2017 with Grace set to play Barbara Gordon in the upcoming comics-based film. More than three decades after being the first Batman on the big screen, Keaton will be once again donning the cape and cowl. The 70-year-old actor recently signed on to return as Batman aka Bruce Wayne in Warner Bros. and HBO Max's Batgirl movie, according to The Hollywood Reporter. Keaton played the very first Dark Knight on the big screen in 1989's Batman, which he reprised in 1992's Batman Returns. The Batgirl movie will follow Barbara, the daughter of Gotham Police Commissioner James Gordon played by J.K. Simmons, reprising his role from Justice League. Adil El Arby and Bilal Falla, Bad Boys for Life, are directing Batgirl from a script by Christina Hodson, Birds of Prey. While the film doesn't have a release date at this time, it is expected to debut on the new streaming service and forego a theatrical release.